Hi everyone. Okay, now it's time for this little gold for shoes because she doesn't have any shoes. And um, I'm actually so, so excited about these shoes I'm going to make. I saw these YouTube videos where they um, use this gel um, cutex for shoes for the doors, but it's always in this time lapse video. So I don't really didn't know what they use and for how long they put it in the ovens. And so I've practiced it and um, actually I, I did it on an old doll and it really does work. It came out beautiful. So now I'm going to make this little one some um, shoes with, well, any gel cutex um, that you use in a UV oven. And so you're obviously going to use a cutex. So I've some of all my glitters and, and um, even sequins and all my stuff I've got here. I want to I want to try this and I'm going to make lots of shoes with this method. So what you're going to need obviously is your um, your UV oven and then your um, UV gel cutex um, for the shoes and then um, a little piece of foam board that I'm going to use for the foot sole and then um, I see they use, usually use these little small tube balloons. Okay, I didn't have any of those, so I just somehow use. I'm going to use cling wrap to put around the feet and just to tie it up with a little. I'm um, using a um, little piece of um, masking tape. Um, oh, you can use any tape you want, like you really want, like. And then um, this um, sterilizer. I can't ever pronounce that name. For um, just to take the tackiness of the uh, um, gel glue off after you've had it in the oven with a little um, cotton bud and then a uh, cotton wool and then yeah, a little cotton bud as well. So yeah, um, that's all the stuff. Oh, and of course your, your glue gun. So I think that's all the stuff I'm going to need. And then, so yeah, let's get started. So first I just put a cling wrap around the foot. I just pull it so it can be a little bit stiff and go everywhere. And then I just tape it down with a little piece of masking tape just to keep it in place. And the same with the other one. Just, just to um, make it come off easier and obviously to protect the doll's foot. So I'm going to make her some black shoes because I've got this little sequence that I'm going to put on the shoes as well. It's just I first thought of let me start with black shoes so it can fit in by, oh, this is not black, this is green. There's my black. Okay, it's just to... Um, because all the so you can just for now fit in by at least she at least she got shoes. So then just nicely just put it on the shoe or on the foot where you approximately and how you want the shoe to be just all around. I don't know, I try to do it as neatly as possible. You can obviously afterwards cut off um, around the foot. And yeah, I'm going to do it at least three times. And then put it in the oven, just lift the legs up so the feet don't touch the inside of the oven. So then I put it um, for one minute on each side. So then I just turn the doll around, lift it again so the back side can get good light as well for another minute.
okay and then this you do at least well i like to do it at least three times so that um the gel can be nice and thick okay so i did it now for three times so before i take the shoe off i just use this um stuff and look um cotton bud And just wipe it just to get the tackiness of the shoes so yeah then you just um take off the um shoe and just try to cut off the most of the um oh that's not from the cotton bud Just careful and damage your door. Okay. And then you can take off the shoe. Okay. And sometimes like this the paper come it out as well so and then you just cut it i'm going to just make some simple slip-ons here for now so i'm just going to cut it nice around Okay, so I cut both the shoes now as neat as possible. Then I'm going to put it back in the oven so it can stand up straight like this. And then for um, two minutes, let it just dry like that in the oven for to so it will dry on the inside. I know this is a bit too um, time consuming to do the shoes, but believe me, the end result is actually beautiful. So yeah, I'll just wait another two minutes. Okay, so now it was in the oven for two minutes. So then I just take a, a cotton bud, also spray it with this um, stuff, and clean the inside of the shoe. all this stuff is going to be on a foot if you don't do that because okay, so I clean, clean both of them so now we can actually make the shoes look nice or finish the shoes off so I'm just going to put it Okay, this now you must see which foot switch one. Just put it back on the foot again. You see, it works perfectly. Oh, damn. Nice. So then I'm going to just use the little foam boards for the foot, for the sole underneath. And for that, I'm going to use my glue gun. And just put a thin layer of glue on the foam board. And press the foot down on that. And then just take the shoe off and um, just cut it around, just straight around, um, put too close and just neaten off the edges. Okay, 
Okay, so um, yeah, I'm gonna put it back. On the fruit, it's just easier to work with it like that. And then I'm gonna small use a permanent marker, just around here, a bit more now for the black, um, for to just cover the glue that is showing. Don't want that. I want everything to be black. And so I'm just going to put three little stones on each foot. So I'm going to use, um, oh, no. so I'm going to use just a, I've got a quick dry normal, just a normal, not a UV oven, just a normal top coat, quick dry one. I'm going to put it here, dot that on the shoe here. toothpick the bit in there just to make a point and then just put my stones there and then I'm just going to my the top glue over the shoe, I'll go there where it needs again. Just run it off nicely. Okay, so this is just a normal top coat. It's not a, um, for the UV oven. You can use your UV oven top coat. So I'm just okay. Wait again until that dry. Like I said, it's a quick dry, so it won't take long. So yeah, these are the little lady's first pair of shoes, so she don't even have to borrow mommy's shoes anymore. And I am so chuffed with this little shoes. It actually came out quite nice and cute, I think. So yeah, this um, UV. Cutex um, for the shoes definitely works. So there's lots more of these shoes and for mommy to come. For. So yeah, there is a first pair of shoes. So yeah, if you like this video, please push that like button. If you want to see more of this, press the subscribe button as well, please. And share, share this video to your friends. And um, yeah, thank you for watching. Bye.